Hey folks, Keith with 93 Lumber coming back at you with another beer. A very special beer because this is Muckraker and it is their birthday blend for their third anniversary. Uh, that is the name of the beer, Birthday Blend 3. And it is, it says 5%, but, but I just looked it up and it says 6% on the thing. So I don't know. It kind of looks like a 6 maybe. So I don't know if he wrote a five and then tried to turn it into a six. But uh, yeah, Kryler. Um, I meant to do this sooner, but uh, I forgot about it. I did the uh, traditional, the traditional forget about the muckraker Kryler in the fridge. And uh, yeah, so today is Tuesday and we went there on Sunday. So This is roughly 48 hours old. And so what this is, is this is an IPA, uh, an IPA, a heavily oated IPA, dry hopped with Citra and Eldorado, blended with a sp spontaneously fermented beer that was conditioned on blood oranges. And if I remember correctly, the ratio is 70% IPA, 30% spontaneous beer. And I don't think, uh, I might be forgetting something, but whatever. But yeah, looks like hazy IPA. Uh, not much of a head. It kind of, it had a bit of like a fizzy, fizzy like, like, uh, like a, a soda or seltzer carbonation thing going on, but I got a ha less than a half a finger of white-ish, maybe eggshell-ish head. But yeah, it's definitely got a shadow through it. Um, but yeah, it's yellowish, orange, dark yellow. It's dark yellow. That's what it is. Yeah. Let's see what it smells like. Yeah, uh, citrus. Yeah, uh, I'm not too familiar with blood orange, but there's a little bit of grapefruit, and then there's another thing, and I think that other thing is blood orange. Yeah, it's got a nice hop character to it as well. Um, there's a bit of a bit of like a tropical, like kind of fruit cocktail thing going on in there. Yeah, it smells like, it smells like an IPA, but there is like a thing that is, it kind of, uh, I know sour IPAs were like, it kind of has a little bit of that going on. It doesn't smell sour, but it, it's got some of that sour IPA funky kind of thing going on. Anyway, let's see what it tastes like. I have not had this yet. Katie had it. I did not. So let's see what it tastes like. Cheers and and uh, here's to uh, many more years of Muckraker. Cheers. Oh yeah. Yeah, you definitely get both things in this. There is a, yeah, like I was never big on the sour IPA things, but this is definitely like, it's definitely not just a sour IPA. It definitely has like spontaneous, wild, whatever beer characteristics to it. Yeah, uh, the citrus character is similar, similar in the taste. Uh, a little bit of grapefruit and then a little bit of a, the other thing that I'm pretty sure is blood orange. Yeah, 
you get that little bit of fruit cocktail thing going on. And same with the nose. It's not as big as it was in the nose, but you get you get the hops in there. And that is very it's very nice. Cause it's it's this is it's it's very nice to get because sometimes you have like blend blended beers and whatever and you get like they're like very one note or two notes and there's like nine different things going on and uh it's it's nice to get all of the notes from all of the things yeah it has a little bit of um an effervescence a little bit um, it, it definitely, that spontaneous beer definitely thinned out that IPA, uh, a little bit, but, um, uh, but, but it, it's very nice. Yeah. Definitely tart. Definitely reminds me of something, I think. Or it could just be reminding me of other Macrager beers. Did I say I had proper, proper glassware? But yeah. Yeah, I'd, I'd say if the sour IPA trend that happened a while ago was more, I don't even know if they still make them. I think, I think every once in a while I see one, but yeah, this is definitely a more, uh, like mature, at least from the ones I had, I, d I didn't really like the ones I had, so I didn't really have that many of them. <clears throat> so who knows if uh, there are actually like better ones out there? I don't know. Um, yeah, getting getting a little bit of a uh, indigestion from this. Which it's like very citrusy, but um, but I wouldn't call it acidic. So it's a little sneaky. In that in that in that realm or in that uh, uh. so anyway cheers to muckrakers third year and hope Tom is uh, keeps doing keeps doing what he's doing um, in 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 every way possible. Um, uh, I feel like I was going to say something. I feel like I meant to say something different there. But that's what came out. So whatever. That's what you get. Uh, so anyway. Uh, hope you are all doing. Hope you are all doing well. Take care of yourselves. Take care of each other. You can like this video if you would like to. Subscribe to the channel if you have not already. You can follow me on Instagram at 93lumber. It's spelled out 93lumber. And uh, we'll see you in the next one. Cheers.